Hi friends, how often do you cry? I didn't used to cry very often. In fact, it was probably a very rare occurrence every couple of years until I had this moment of kind of insight into emotional intelligence, um, which I talk about in my, in my TEDx talk. And I really started to focus on understanding emotions, my own emotions, first of all. And I realized there was a lot of stuff that um, I had maybe tried to lock away inside somewhere, and that's um, really not a good idea. And I think that this is not, I mean, this is not a problem unique to me. This is, I think, a problem that our society faces as a whole. And Switzerland, where I live now, has one of the highest suicide rates in the world. And I just wonder whether that has something to do with the fact that um, if we see somebody cry, um, our kind of social instinct is um, to think that there's something really wrong and that we should somehow get that person to stop crying. And that is, I think, really the wrong way to look at that. I think um, there's a real danger that we block off people's ability to express emotions by reacting that way. And so... I've talked before about the kind of difference between knowing something and really acting it out. It took me a long time to progress from understanding the importance of emotional expression and then also living it. And I think now um, I was thinking about this because um, earlier today I was I was watching something and I and I cried a little bit and and I just thought to myself, I hope nobody sees me because um, I wonder what they will think and that is kind of part of the problem you know it's like if we don't feel like we can express our emotions truly fully in, in our bo whole body then we lose the connection between our minds and our bodies and that um that's that's really dangerous so um i don't know i guess this is a little bit of a different topic than what i've talked about in the past couple of blogs but um i just think that that's something to think about um and uh yeah so i'm just curious um, how do you feel about expressing your emotions, especially negative emotions? But I think I think the same is true for positive emotions too. You know, if you get too excited, too happy, then people start to think there's something wrong with you as well. So, um, the we we especially I guess it's kind of the in the um, in in sort of I guess Central European um, Anglo-Saxon cultures, we tend to be a little bit less expressive emotionally, and um, I don't think that's necessarily. A good thing. I don't think it's a good thing at all, actually. Um, but uh, yeah, so I'm curious um, what your experience with that is, and um, how do you, you know, express yourself emotionally, and um, how do you make sure that you don't let the kind of social expectations, kind of in the judgment, um, change the way that you act towards the world. I'm curious about that. So that's it. And see you tomorrow. <laughs>